And that was musical artist Livingston's new single, Say the Word, inspired by the Together Without Hunger initiative by Panera Bread to provide meals to those in need during the COVID-19 pandemic. And here to tell us more about this very important campaign is Panera CEO, Niran Chaudhry. Thank you for being with us. And I want you to tell us all about Panera's partnership right now with Feeding America. What are you all doing? Yeah, you know, this uh, health crisis is fast becoming a financial and a humanitarian crisis. Um, 55 million Americans will suffer from hunger, and 20% of the food banks may run out of food in the next four or five weeks, and uh, we just can't accept that. We need to all step up and, and help in any way possible. Uh, so we've uh, partnered with Feeding America and launched this campaign called Together Without Hunger, and uh, we would love to serve up to half a million meals to children and families most impacted by the pandemic through Feeding America. And to raise awareness uh, and generate uh, donations, we have created a challenge called See a Plate, Fill a Plate. And essentially, we would love for people to donate at least $3 by going to togetherwithouthunger.org, take an empty plate, decorate it, take a selfie, tag five friends, and spread the movement so that we can all come together and fight hunger. That's incredible. And I know that as states begin to reopen, what are you going to do in terms of your service? Are you going to resume dine-in service? And tell us how you're currently keeping patrons and employees safe while still serving. Yeah, I think we're going to follow all the federal state guidelines, of course, but we have developed our own guidelines as well to ensure the ongoing safety of our associates and customers. And that is the most important thing that we need to take care of. So we're going to be, uh, you know, uh, we, we had actually kept almost 85 to 90 percent of our cafes open even through the crisis, but mostly through off premise access. But now, as we begin to reopen, we'll re reopen the dine-ins in phases and be very mindful of ensuring safety and do it in a very controlled fashion. So we're working through a series of steps like wellness stations to take the temperature of our employees, plexiglass glass barriers uh, for our cashiers, social distancing protocols in the dining areas, frequent sanitation and hygiene protocols, and so on. Uh, so, so really uh, working through it to ensure that the safety is not compromised in any way. As you mentioned, most of your Panera locations are open for pickup and delivery. How many of your employees, though, have your stores and franchise locations had to furlough, and how are you helping those employees? You know, it's been uh, a major disruption to the business, uh, uh, and I think we've had to unfortunately furlough employees across the franchise and the company cafes. So we're doing a, a series of things, for example, an emergency relief fund to help our associates, including furloughed associates, for uh, any near time urgent help that they might need, uh, providing free family meals once a week to all of our associates, including furloughed associates. And then we also partnered with uh, brands like CVS and Walmart, who, you know, fortunately are hiring at this time uh, to ensure that there is a frictionless uh, uh, opportunity for our associates to get hired uh, with them and then they can come back to us uh, once we're ready. Well, thank you for all that you're doing for your community and for your employees as well. And we certainly wish you the best. Thank you, Noreen Chaudhry, for being with us today. We appreciate your time. Thank you very much. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.